Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use Pinocchio and Forge to run the Flux image generation model. So if you are having a low power computer like I do, then Flux Web UI will most likely run out of memory. I think maybe some recommendations were like 12 gigabytes of GPU memory. And yeah, this model also requires uh, NVIDIA GPU, as does the Forge, since that's what Flux needs. But this one should run with as low as 3 gigabytes of VRAM. So let's try this one out. If you don't want to try Pinocchio and running something on your computer locally, and you want to rather do it on the cloud without installing anything locally, then check down below in the description my video for using Mimic PC. That's a nice way of running it on the cloud. So now when this web UI has launched, uh, we can see that this is the Flux 1 model it's using. And we have text to image here we can give the prompt like we can say dog there's a negative prompt for things which you don't want and all you can adjust let's do a smaller image so that's a bit faster and a lot of parameters which i really don't know how to use yet can say um gpu memory I think so this is tricky but I really have four so let's try and generate an image and see how long it takes so it might seem at first that nothing is happening but if you check the terminal it's doing some memory management and checking how much memory I have and so on but in a few moments it should give an estimation of of how long it takes to run. Okay, now it's showing that it's 40% done and the ETA is one minute. But really, this is now in real time and the time is getting smaller and faster than than what it takes. But anyhow, it's it's not super fast. It's It's not 10 seconds like you would be able to do on a high power laptop or if you try mimic pc on the cloud i think that's under 10 seconds even with the lowest uh, settings but you know this is one way of of running flux locally if you have a low lower power pc and i think the the images turn out really nice this was a very simple prompt and i think the the image looks really good. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.